Hey guys, so this is going to be my 14 week update. I'm currently about 126 pounds, I believe, somewhere around there. The baby is the size of a lemon this week and is 3.4 inches long, 1.5 ounces this week. Um, this week your baby is probably sucking its tiny little thumbs. The baby's kidneys are also now producing urine and their spleen is working as it's supposed to be. Baby is also growing lango. Lango. I don't know how to say that, but it's that peachy, um, it's like peachy oil that's on over their skin to protect. There's chance that you might see it when the baby is born, depending on what gestation the baby is born. The baby has also doubled its weight this week, so that's kind of cool. As far as prenatal and ultrasound goes, my next prenatal isn't until June 18th and I will have an ultrasound sometime after that, probably between the 18 to 20 week mark. And I did call in about 3 to 40 ultrasound and apparently have to wait till like 24 weeks. So I'm not exactly sure. Um, we might wait a little bit longer to do the 3D40, like more around like 30 week mark. And um, considering that it won't be for gender purposes, like finding out what the gender is, it doesn't really matter if it would be later on in the pregnancy. Um, but that's just what they were suggesting that we do. My symptoms this week, I'm still nauseous, but it lifts up in the afternoon. Um, I'm still dizzy when I first wake up until I drink a couple cups of water. I am nauseous as soon as I take my um, prenatal pills. Um, I've been trying to take them with food, but it's still I still feel pretty nauseous when taking them. I'm still getting headaches in the morning as well, which really sucks. It is like a really crappy way to start your day, having a headache right off the bat. I'm still tired, although I'm finding that I have more energy and I'm getting my energy and motivation back. Um, I've been able to get more done this week, so it, that's always a plus side. I'm still very bloated, my belly is sore, I am quite like big I feel. I'm definitely starting to feel a little bit more uncomfortable. Um, my bed sucks and I'm starting to realize that my bed sucks a lot. Um, it's just an old bed, we've had it since me and Dustin started dating and I definitely need a new bed because this bed is definitely worn out and I'm starting to feel it on my body and stuff. I'm getting more sore in like my lower back and my legs and stuff cramp up more during. I'm having issues getting to sleep at night and I'm finding that the only way that I can fall asleep is on my right side. My skin has also been horrible still. I was hoping that it would calm down in the second trimester but it seems to be just as bad as in the first trimester. As far as cravings this week, I've been craving ice cream, smoothies, frozen yogurt, um, sweets, chocolates, basically anything that is not good for me I've been craving. I'm still enjoying the veggies and dip and I'm still enjoying fruit and I'm still enjoying cereal and I'm still liking milk products like cheese and milk and um, cream cheese and basically anything, yogurt, um, I'm really enjoying it and I can't seem to get enough. I've definitely seen a huge increase in appetite um, in this past week. I still am also liking small snacks like two night crackers or um, cheese and crackers as far as the versions go this week. Basically just cooked vegetables is the only thing that I haven't been able to eat and I haven't tried craft dinner again so we'll just throw that on the list too. Craft dinner I'm assuming I probably can't eat. I'm not going to try it again. Sorry that this vlog is probably going to be quite short. There wasn't really a whole bunch to update on. Um, that's basically everything so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys my belly.
anyways, I think that's basically everything for week 14.